today, we're going to mash up tap and country. Country dancing is a social dance, which means you do it for fun with other people. Let's start with the country part of our routine. Imagine you have some cowboy boots on, and you're at a country hoedown. Awesome. Hi. Hi. I'm really looking forward to the country tap mashup, because they're both kind of like energetic and like kind of sharp movements. So I think they would go well together. We're going to start with this foot, and we're going to step, and we're going to tap our heel. Then we're going to step on that foot and tap our toe. We go step, heel, step, toe. Say it with me. Step, heel, step, toe. Step, heel, step, toe. Step, heel, step, toe. Step, heel, step, toe. Now that you know the hoedown move, we're going to move on to tap. I think the tap section will be a bit more difficult to teach than the country section, but we'll see. Country and tap together? I don't think so. We're gonna learn a basic tap move called a shuffle. Cool. We're gonna start off by brushing the ball of your foot, which is the toe, and we're gonna brush forward and brush back. Forward and back. Forward, back, forward, back. Let's try it on the other side. Forward and back. Brush forward and back. Forward and back, forward and back. The country part was okay. The tap part was a bit like. Now we're gonna shuffle with this foot and then we're gonna step and clap. We'll go shuffle, step, clap. Shuffle, step, clap. Shuffle, step, clap. Shuffle, step, clap. Let's try with the other foot. Six, seven, eight. Shuffle, step, clap. Shuffle, Step, clap, shuffle, step, clap, shuffle, step, clap. Kylie, I have a question. What do we do with our arms? Great question, Lily. In country dance, our upper body is pretty still, but often people just hang their hands in their belt loops. But in tap dancing, our arms are used a lot. What do you think we should do? What if we switch them up? So tap arms for the country part and country arms for the tap part. Great idea. It would really help us mash up the two styles. Let's move our arms nice and loose for the first count of eight, and for the second count of eight, we'll put them in our belt loops. Does that sound good? Yeah. yeah. What if we don't have belt loops? You can just pretend and put your hands on your hips. I got belt loops. Same, buckaroo. Same. It will look like this. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. That totally works. This will be a great mashup. Does anyone have any questions? What if we're not wearing any tap shoes? Tap is all about making sounds with your feet. Try it with your sneakers and let me hear. Exactly, dancers. I think I like tap, but more than country because my feet move faster in tap. Ethan, are you ready to show us the entire routine? I sure am. Ow. Go, Ethan. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'll count you in. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. 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 Five, six, seven, eight. Good job, my buckaroo. Great work. I think the perfect place to perform tap and country mashup would be Texas. Great work, dancers. All your hard work will definitely pay off in our finale. But before we do that, we should have some... Freestyle fun! It's finale time. 
Lucky for us, with a little imagination, we can perform anywhere. Let's close our eyes and open them in five, six, seven, eight. Can you think of a better place to perform our country tap finale? It's perfect. Put up your hands and dance all night. Sh shake it, yeah, it just feels right, yeah. Just live it like your best life. We got the feeling and we'll never let go. Never let go, never let go. Never let go of this feeling. Never let go, never let go. Never let go of this feeling, yeah. Of this feeling, yeah. Put up your hands. It doesn't matter if you've never danced before. Just take it step by step. See you next time.